Shalom Israel. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And Shalom to the elect men doing his work in truth and in sincerity. We are we are in another day, you know, saying of captivity. And just thinking upon it, you gotta be mad. You know, we of course take fault for our own sins, but you gotta be really be mad at a nigga, man. You know, a nigga is in your way, a nigga is in his own way, man. And most importantly, he's in the way of the plans of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai. You know, a so called white man is gonna be the devil, a heathen is just gonna be vain. All right, but Israel, we are special people, man. And the, the most high required of us to repent, man. If we did, if all Israel did so, which we know it's not gonna happen, and we turn turn the face to east, then the most high will have no choice but to deliver us, man. You know, but a nigga don't don't give ear to the word. All right, he's not humble, he's not shamefaced, and that's why he has to be destroyed. All right, because he's in a way he's, he's uh he's messing up the program, so to speak. You know, he's messing up the program. Like a, you know, what I'm saying he, he he just don't belong. That's why the Most High got to do away with uh two thirds of, of Israel, which is so called Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. And the two thirds, all right, those are the ones. That, you know, said to Yahweh Shai, you know, well, said to the Romans, let his blood be upon us and our families, man. You know? So since from day one, man, they've been persecuting the men of the Lord and Yahweh Shai, man. And persecuting his word, man. You know? So you just got to really be mad at a nigga, man, because, like I said, he's in the way, man. All right? A nigga is a scoffer. A nigga is a fucking, um... What do you call that? A federal agent. You know? A nigga come past the camp not even knowing what a brother's talking about and want to scoff, man. You know? As the scriptures say, offenses must come, man. But it's always going to come through a nigga, man. Well, I, I, I won't say always, but a lot of times we, we find that to be true, man. It's always coming through a nigga. Saying some, some uh, madness out, out of his head, man. The scriptures say... You know, that's why it's so important to, uh, you know, to repent, too. The scriptures say the most high is with the contrite and, and humble heart, man. You know? Those that knew that they did wrong and, and willing to fix it, man. All right? But a two-thirds don't care, man. A two-third to know that his actions is wrong, but he would still, he would still carry on in it, man. He was still wallowing his sins, man. So, you know, just a quick uh, lesson about, you know, why we say two-thirds of Israel have to die. Why we say they're just not going to get it, man. You know? So they're going to have to be destroyed because they in a way. They're messing up the program. So with that, I hope brothers edified. Shalom, Israel.